wheat guac. Four Mexican munchies. The addition of a little Mary Jane makes this easily the best guacamole recipe ever. You don't even have to make a fancy wheat tincture first. Just grind your buds into a fine powder, then combine with the usual suspects. The strong and delicious taste of onion, garlic, and avocado easily drown out any lingering wheat flavor. Cannabis Stewoni Ice Cream Because the spaghetti factory is expensive, Cannabis Cherry Ice Cream made from cannabis milk with sugar and cherries is the base for this Italian dessert. With the help of extra chopped pistachios and chocolate chips, you won't taste a hint of hash. Mary Jane Lobster Roll Mary Jane Lobster Roll Weezits Weezits Marijuana Bacon Marijuana Bacon Cush Corn Bread Cush Corn Bread Chronic Chai The best part of waking up is marijuana in your cup. No morning is complete without a little coffee, but if you're looking to make your day extra relaxing. Marijuana French Toast Marijuana French Toast Chronic Tacos Infinitely better than Taco Bell. Layer cannabis butter, refried beans, seasoned ground beef, and cheese on a tortilla, then prepare to bake and get baked. When the cheese has melted, top with weed covering ingredients like tomatoes, onions, and cilantro. Repeat as many times as necessary. Cinnamon Roll Oatmeal Cookies Baked to perfection. Everyone's got their own signature cookie recipe. Make this one yours by mixing cinnamon roll instant oatmeal with can of butter and sugar for a delicious, satisfying treat. The cinnamon in your instant oatmeal will also instantly mask the marijuana flavors from your butter. Stoner Snickerdoodles Ultimate challenge, get high, say the word snickerdoodles without laughing. Another irresistible cookie recipe. This one uses marijuana coconut oil and plenty of cinnamon and sugar coating so all you taste is sweet perfection. Ganyan Jerk Chicken Banana Canna Pancakes Get your day's worth of potassium. Made with marijuana flour and milk, these sweet pancakes are the perfect way to sneak a little fruit and herb into your diet. Just mix all of the ingredients together and throw them on the griddle. A strong banana flavor and a bunch of maple syrup help drown out the taste of pot. Top with extra bananas if you're feeling healthy. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below and also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.